Hi everyone. Today I wanted to show you how to make your own salt tray at home. You only need a few things. You'll need a tray or you could even use a plate that has tall sides. You'll need a little scoop and you can use salt. That's what we use at school or cornmeal or sand. I have sugar, so I'm going to use that. And then you'll need something that has letters on it. So I have our sound deck that has all the letters, but if you have a poster that has letters, or if you have sandpaper letters, or if you have something else that has letters on it so that you can look at it while you write in your sand tray or salt tray or sugar tray. So I'm going to use my scoop. I don't want to fill it up too, too much, just a thin layer so that the bottom of my tray is covered up. So I like to put in a few scoops and then shake it up. And if when you shake it up, the whole bottom is covered, then that's enough. So I have enough in here. And then I can have my letters right in front of me. The first one is L, O. I'm gonna trace over my letter and then draw it in my sugar. When I want to practice the next one, I give my tray a little shake so that it goes back to normal. And my le next letter is Z. Z, zebra, Z. And I'm gonna trace it on my paper and then write it in my sugar. C, zebra, Z. And I'll show you one more. J, jam, J. And you can practice as many letters as you want. Sometimes I like to draw in my tray too and that's okay. The only thing I would say is to remember to use just one finger and not all of them. It's best to practice with one finger. And then when you want your letter to disappear, you keep your tray on the ground or on the table and you move it back and forth like that and that clears it. So to make your sand tray, you need a tray or plate with tall sides. You need sugar, salt, cornmeal, or sand, and then a scoop if you're scooping it in. And remember, just put enough so that the bottom is covered. I hope you have fun making your own tray and you can keep it somewhere safe so that when you want to use it again, it's available. Bye.